wasn't that popular of a candidate, at least mm -hmm. before the primaries in South Carolina. Mm -hmm. You know, up until that point, he wasn't even in the game as Fair far point. as a lot of people were concerned. And so because of that, when you look at it from that perspective, Chris, what it comes down to is you're going to have people sitting up there on his side and saying they can't beat him legitimately and it's going to add right. it's going to it's going to add momentum to his argument that they're exhausting themselves with doing everything they can to prevent him from being the republican nominee because they can't beat him yeah that's what they're going to say well, no that's matter his what case ladies and gentlemen now even the far left extremists are saying what we all know in a free and fair election they can't beat Trump. So that's why they have to indict him. They have to throw dirt and shade on his name. But guess what? It's not going to work. Trump 2024 or sooner.